Hello guys, hope you all are doing good. So if your laptop or desktop screen is totally black, as you can see, the screen is totally black. Only my cursor is working. To fix this issue, the first step you can try is refresh the graphic driver. For this, you have to press the shift key, control key, window key and this B button. So you have to press all the four keys together to refresh your graphic driver. Press control key, shift key, window key and this B button. Press all the four keys together. This will refresh the graphic driver and fix the error. But if you are still getting the same error, same issue, move on to a next method. Open the task manager. For this, press control key, shift key and this skip key. So you have to press all the three, uh, three keys together. Control key, shift key and this skip key. Press all the three keys together. This will open the task manager in your system. Now click on this process tab and here you can see these are the services I have in my system. Now you have to search for a service called Windows Explorer. So scroll down and this is the service we need Windows Explorer. Select this service and after that click on this restart button. So this will restart your Windows Explorer and this will also fix the error. But if you are still getting the same issue, move on to a next step. In the task manager, you will see a tab startup. Click on it. And here you can see these are the startup applications I have in my system. So disable all the startup applications by right click on it. Then click on disable. Disable all the startup applications like this okay so disable all the startup application after that cut this window now you have to restart your system so to restart your system what you have to do is you have to press control key this one control key alt key and the delete button so you have to press control key alt key and delete key together you have to press all the three keys together and this will open uh, this kind of window. Now click on this power tab, power button, click here, then click on restart. So this will restart your system and this will also fix the error. So these are the three methods you can try. 